Hey everybody, welcome back to Jay's Car Channel. I'm going to be doing a really quick video today on showing how to enable keyless remote on your Crown Victoria. This works on a 2008 to 2011 police interceptor. They have the driver door module that works for keyless remote. It's just not enabled um, as a standard, so by default it's disabled. So what you need to do is go in, you need to download a program called Forescan. And then you need to get a little connector. I'll show you. It's, it's plugs down into the uh, OBD2 port. It's called a DB Fly. I'm going to leave links to the um, to that product as well as the uh, keyless remotes that I got. So I'll leave links to all that in there. Once you have the ignition turned on, hit the connect icon at the bottom of the uh, Forescan program, and then it will take you through a series of prompts. Ask you if you want to save your configuration for your vehicle. I always select yes on that. So you're going to click on this icon here on the left underneath the wrench. And then after you've clicked on that, you go to DDM configuration as built. Select that, go down to the uh, play button, hit that. It's going to give you a warning. Just click through that. And then you want to find... A08, that value is 2815, you want to change it to 2915, and then go over and click the uh, right button, and it's going to give you a format error, just click yes, and then it's going to say, alright, please cycle the ignition off and then back on, click OK, so go back here. Off and back on. And now what you're going to do is cycle the ignition eight times. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Take your remote now after you've done that and now it's paired to the car. I'm also going to go into uh, LCM and see if I can make some changes in there. So click on that, execute button, click OK. And I've got dark car, which is enabled. Actually, I'm gonna disable the dark car. So double click on it, click on disable, and click the check button. And then click down here where it says right. Please confirm these changes. Click the check button. Good to go. All right, cycle the ignition off and on. So that's done. I'm also going to uh, enable daytime running lamps. So double click on that. And click enabled. Click the check box. Just enabled and then down here where it says right, click on the right and click on the check again. So now I've got dark mode disabled and daytime running lights enabled. So what else can you play with? I'll go down here and stop running this one. So I want to enable auto unlock, auto lock. Uh, lock confirmation flash also the smart unlock which means if the key is in the ignition it will not allow you to lock the door so I'm going to go through here and that's again in the DDM module configuration and I'm not going to show you or bore you going through all these and and um, switching them to enabled or disabled I'm just going to tell you those are the ones I'm going to do so you know again once you do that then you click down there on the right uh, button and then those will be saved. So those are some cool features you can turn on on your Crown Vic. Hope this video is helpful to everybody. Um, useful information. Again, I'm going to leave the links to the, uh, to the cable and the uh, keyless remotes that I bought to use for this. So uh, thanks for watching and uh, see you guys on the next one.